just finished about a, I give or take, 15 minute, 20 minute walk. It's been just, just under two hours since she had her first trazodone. Good job that we started the walk. So, I, she's been on alert. And I know it's because there's a, I know partially because there's a lot of prey out there right now. But I don't know if it has anything to do with the trazodone. Because normally when we walk back up the street, she's relieved and excited and jumping on me and just more relaxed and sniffing all the things. And you can tell here she's alert. Not necessarily stressed per se, but alert. I don't know if it's because she thinks there's another animal somewhere or what's going on. But this is our first. Leave it, Kira, please. Come on. Good girl. First Trazodone dose. She has one again at 11.30 in the morning and I will take another video of her around 1.30, maybe even 2 just to be safe tomorrow on our walk. It's going to be a lot more triggers, a lot less animals, so see if there's a difference. So this is her third dose with Trazodone and she's a lot more mellow usually. This is our semi-regular route. Normally she'd be pulling on the leash. Leash has basically been loose the entire time. Sometimes she's even been heel on her own. Her tail is pretty neutral. It's not like up and wagging, but it's not down either. It's been like that most of the walk. Her ears are a little bit back on and off, but I want to say it's an issue. She heard some noises and she was interested in checking it out, but not really scared. So it's all pretty good. I'm going to get to a busier street in a bit and I'll take another video and see if there's any difference. Like that. Checking out the sign, but okay, a little bit nervous there. I'm only looking because that's usually where we go for our runs. We're not going there because it's late. Yeah, take another video in a bit. All right. We are on the busier street. Hi, good girl. She's a bit more alert, but her tail's basically been in the same position the entire walk. This is the most she's pulled. She's also stopping to sniff things, which she never does when she comes around here. She's not something she, she can't handle walking through, but she doesn't really stop to sniff things. So that's a good sign. Her tail is a bit lower, like I said, on and off. Good girl. But... This is an interesting difference, so I'll admit that much. Good girl. Okay. It's okay, baby. We'll be out of here soon. Now, I know part of the reason why she is looking around is because we always see skunks and raccoons and squirrels and all those fun little critters around here especially over here so I know part of her is looking to see if there's any creatures around but I can tell she is a bit anxious as well and now we're stopping for some reason what's up come on baby good girl so I said this little bit the walk has been Really nice for a change. So who knows, maybe the trazodone is making a difference. Check again in tomorrow morning. Out. Hi baby, good girl. So, this was her fourth, fourth? Yeah, I believe fourth dose. No, fifth dose, I guess. Anyways, it's the day after the last video. Uh, it's an hour, three hours roughly, since she was given the medication. We're not going to go for a long walk, but see how she's feeling. 
I will say that this is one of our more normal routes, and she's not usually too bad. This is about her norm for her going. I'm trying to get all of her body in here. Yeah, this is her norm. And, um, so shut up. <laughs> Let you watch. Just a bit more from her walk right now. So, this is just beside our building. She guided me over here and she wanted to jump up and smell it and check it out and now uh, we've been here for like five minutes waiting for her to want to come down. We had three people on bikes come by and uh, she was pretty nervous of that. Made her jump a little, spooked her. Tails not high, but it's not like, it's fully tucked either. It's, you know, is what it is. Yeah, she's been very on edge, and now we're just gonna sit apparently. If I try and even use treats, Kira, Kira, focus. She'll look for a second, and if I give her a treat, it's very absent minded, just going with the flow. Figure there's something interesting to uh, the video. Also, that lovely drool, because she hardly ever drools. Two and a half hours after her her dose was given. It's Saturday the eleventh, I believe, in April. Kira, come on. Good girl. You see a squirrel across the street. Let's go. Good girl. <gasps> oh, it's a happy girl. <laughs> oh my goodness, a butt scratches. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh my goodness! <laughs> Thank you. Will you help me? Oh my goodness! What you doing? I can help you. So we uh, went to stop by our local park <clears throat> to take a breather because just needed one. And um, normally, in the past, before I knew better, when we came here and i try and sit down with her, she would either just pace back and forth and look around. She still is looking around, but she never ever just chilled. This is not even four minutes in to being here. And she sat down calmly. She's just chilling. It is almost 3 a.m., so that helps a lot because Zeus no one else around basically but um yeah I figure this is another update it's worth mentioning she was still looking around but she was calm enough to sniff around like she's doing just now and she was licking herself earlier which that's very 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 rare for her unless she's feeling comfortable so yay maybe <laughs> It's another update. So this is another video for Kira walking. It's about an hour, 45-ish minutes, 40 minutes after Kira got her med. Uh, normally Shauna walks her. I'm her fiance walking her this time just because Shauna hurt her foot. And we'll see how this goes. Right, Kira? Oh, it's okay. Good girl. Just 
No one here. Nothing. You're okay. Kira. Hi. Tail tail light for a second. 